Okay, friends, today is 22 December 2019, and I'm in New Bern, Alabama, and this is the site of a Christenberry, William Christenberry, uh, one of his images. It was called Horses and Black Buildings. And in his lectures, uh, he made some different, you know, he made various lectures throughout his life, and one of them, he mentions a Mr. Walthall. I believe this property was owned by a Mr. Walthall, and he tells the joke of uh, the black paint, you know. He was in Ohio, I think, at Ohio State University one time lecturing. And he was showing his slides and a student asked, why are the buildings painted black in such a hot climate? And then Mr. Walthall, he said, well, when you have a lot of spare paint lying around, you use what you have. So the the buildings were painted black. But again, of course, in the, in the summer heat, that would right absorb all the sun and make the buildings quite a bit hotter. But anyways, this has been photographed over the years by, by different photographers. And when, when uh, Chris and Barry, you know, he was known for revisiting the same spots uh, every summer. He lived in Washington, D.C., and he would come back to Hale County, Alabama, just about every summer and re-photograph the same sites every year because he wanted to track the progress of the sites and see how the effect that time was having on the different structures. And this is uh, this is one of the buildings here, and you can remember the horses were here in this open field. Another photographer came here some years ago, and it was donkeys, and now it's cows. So it's been horses, and then donkeys, and now cows. So it's kind of funny in a way that uh, even the animals are changing. Uh, the buildings are really no longer black. The black has just been faded by the sun. It's almost uh, a bare metal now. It's it's a rust, kind of a rusty brown, and it's just beautiful to me. This is absolutely beautiful. I'm just so honored, you know, to stand in the same spot that Chris and Barry stood to take these photos. And a lot of his photos were here in New Bern, and New Bern is very small. So when it comes to, like, uh, density, you know, like photography density, you can get a lot of pictures here in New Bern and travel a very short distance. So if, if you want to come to one town that's very target rich for photography it would definitely be New Bern. Okay again uh, Horses and Black Houses William Christenberry. Thank you.